Hi, Drew Embry with PNL Technology here, and today our video tip is on managing your contacts with Microsoft Link. Microsoft Link has made a huge difference in our office. We're able to quickly send instant messages with our coworkers and get quick bits of information back from them, and then also see their status and who's available and who's not available. There's a couple of easy ways to manage your contacts in Microsoft Link. One is you can just simply type the name. So, for example, if I want to find Bree, I can find Bree and it finds her name and I can double click it and then have an instant message conversation with Bree. Another very useful thing is to use the favorites. So again, let's see, let's find Logan this time. There we see Logan's available. I can right click Logan's name and add him to the favorites. Uh, now I have Logan now in my favorites and I can communicate with him uh, very easily without having to type his name each time. One of the really handy features of Link that not too many people know about is you can actually use your company distribution groups, though, however, in Link. So we have one, um, it's called All Omaha Employees, and it has everyone in our organization in our Omaha office in there. I'm going to go ahead and right click and choose Add to Contacts List. And now you see All Omaha Employees, and if I hit the drop down, it's got uh, our entire staff there listed. The beautiful thing about that is if we add or hire new people or if we say goodbye to existing employees, that list will be automatically updated and anybody who uses that list in their Microsoft link won't have to remember to add or remove people as they come and go. So I hope this tip has helped you today. If there's any other uh, videos you'd like to see, please feel free to let us know.